February 8th, The Cost of Sanctification. 1 Thessalonians 5.23 says, May the God of peace himself sanctify you completely. When we pray, asking God to sanctify us, are we prepared to measure up to what that really means? We take the word sanctification much too lightly. Are we prepared to pay the cost of sanctification? The cost will be a deep restriction of all our earthly concerns and an extensive cultivation of all our godly concerns. Sanctification means to be intensely focused on God's point of view. It means to secure and to keep all the strength of our body, soul, and spirit for God's purpose only. Are we really prepared for God to perform in us everything for which He separated us? And after He has done with His work, are we then prepared to separate ourselves to God just as Jesus did? John 17, 19 says, For their sakes I sanctify myself. The reason some of us have not entered into the experience of sanctification is that we have not realized the meaning of sanctification from God's perspective. Sanctification means being made one with Jesus so that the nature that controlled Him will control us. Are we really prepared for what that would cost? It would cost absolutely to be caught up in the full meaning of Paul's prayer in this verse? Are we prepared to say, Lord, make me a sinner saved by grace as holy as we can? Jesus prayed that we might be one with him, just as he is one with the Father in John 17, 21 to The resounding evidence of the Holy Spirit in a person's life is the unmistakable family likeness to Jesus Christ and the freedom from everything which is not like Him. Are we prepared to set ourselves apart for the Holy Spirit's work in us?